Hi everybody, and welcome to Survival Dads. I apologise for the setting, um, it's a bit dark, and my look of woodland. I'm currently filming a time lapse. While I'm waiting for that to uh, sort itself out, I thought I'd talk about this, if you can see it. This is one half of my lavu. It is a, I'm trying to light on it. It is the uh, slightly camouflaged pattern, um, as you may have seen in my Lavu introduction video. And uh, yeah, so I want to show it off, so uh, we'll get to it. Okay, so the awesome thing about a Lavu is they generally come in two parts. I believe this one is a Hungarian version, uh, but the Polish is exactly the same. So they come in two roughly triangle shapes. They button together and create a two-man slash one-man shelter. Uh, originally, I believe each person was issued with one half, and also doubles as a poncho. So uh, I'll chuck it on and I'll show you how it looks. So all I've done is I have gone two buttons down. And just done one button up. Placed it over my head. Put my arms through the armholes. Hopefully you can see. Again, I apologise for the lighting, but it is almost midnight. And yeah, I have a bit of a hood. Bit of a hood there to help keep the rain off and I have a nice poncho to uh, help keep the rain off so I have the poncho on I'd like to talk a little bit now about how a poncho is quite helpful in this kind of environment okay so obviously its primary purpose is to keep you uh, dry in rain uh, with this being a canvas material um, it's pretty much been surpassed by uh, modern materials, but it does still do the job. Um, you can waterproof this with nick wax or something like that. I've left it as it is, because um, I quite like the fact that it's not very flammable, uh, so I can have it quite close to a campfire. Another awesome aspect of it being canvas is it's quite warm. So if I was really cold, I could tuck my arms in, run it all the way up, and it will... Uh, keep me nice and warm and toasty. With it being a poncho, I have full freedom of movement to do what I want. So, going to the toilet, performing camp tasks, uh, or whatever else, handling a weapon if that's what I want to do. Um, there's no problem whatsoever with that. Another really awesome aspect of a uh, poncho is it breaks the uh, silhouette of a person up. So if I was to stick my hands in, I might put my head up as well. I can uh, blend into my surroundings a lot easier. I don't look quite as human shaped. And again, with it being this material, it doesn't reflect light very well. And uh, it should keep you hidden if that's what you're after. And also the pattern's awesome. I think this is much better than the uh, Polish one. Sorry, Polish guys. Um, but yeah, so I'll just wander around a little bit now. Uh, hopefully you can kind of see me a little bit. And uh, yeah, I just wanted to kind of show it off, really. I don't really use it as a uh, tent like I should do. Um, I'll probably use it more in the winter. Simply because I don't like spiders. Um, but for this kind of weather, it's dry, but it's really cold. Um, it's currently in November. It's awesome for uh, keeping warm and doing camp tasks. So I'll have a bit of a wander around, see if you can spot me.